Hey what's going on guys this is Anish and I'm back with another video and for this video I'm gonna go ahead and complete the SBC that I absolutely love. I love this card and it is the footies Curtis Jones and let me tell you one thing I'm a Liverpool fan all my life you have probably seen my team in the last video if you haven't please check that out but Curtis Jones is a player that I was rooting for for so long. I watched him in 2016 in the uh, friendlies and I was in absolute love with this card. Uh, I mean the player not the card but when they came out with the future stars card this year I was in love with that card too and it is so amazing to see him being the best card the best Liverpool midfielder you can buy right now or you could just compete and uh, let's just go through his stats because this is definitely one of those cards that I'm definitely going to get so it is a 91 pace card his dribbling is again 95 so you know he is going to be amazing 99 agility and to acceleration that is probably the best thing you can get in the midfielder if you're playing him box to box again he's got 88 defense so you know for a fact that this is going to be the Gerard card that you've always wanted but sadly they've nerfed Gerard. so I mean this is the card that I'm going to use in my team primarily in place of Gini when I'm going to take him out and the only thing that I feel is a downside to this card is the flare a long shoot would be amazing because he curls those balls of finesse shots in real life are amazing but anyways I absolutely love this card and I am definitely going to get him a hammer I am a little short on coins right now probably uh, I have enough but it's going to take me some time to snipe the cards that I might need to complete him but without further ado let's just get straight into the SBCs so we got three SBCs the first one is the Liverpool SBC which is an 81 rated 80 chemistry team the second one is a Premier League one with an 83 rated team with 75 chemistry and you need at least one team of the week or one team of the season player so i have a pretty unique solution to that and the last one is the 85 rated 85 rated sbc which again is going to be a little bit of a mix but in total in my opinion after i do the math it comes up to 180 190k it might be a little more expensive for players playing on xbox it might be a little different for players playing on, uh, on pc but this is basically how much it's going to cost so the first one is going to be the Liverpool one and rare cards are super expensive right now so I would recommend just going and bidding on players instead of buying them so let's just go ahead and complete the first one I'm gonna play a bit of a mix here I'm gonna start off with the goalkeepers and that's Fabianski and I have one more goalkeeper in the team just for the chemistry because you need 80 chemistry so for center defensive midfielder we got Torreira and left back we got Ben Chilwell that's gonna be a perfect link right here 10 on 10 and um, then we got the other center back that we need but i'm going to play a center defensive midfielder and Hoy Bier, i should say sorry and doherty so that creates another perfect link right here and then we have a center defensive midfielder we're going to play matic and for cm we're going to play nabi kaita for right mate or the right wing we're going to play shakiri with richarlison up front and johnny from wolves a left wing that completes the first one it should give you enough chemistry plus it'll give you a little more than you need plus an 81 rated team should cost you about 40 to 50 thousand coins depending on the players how much you snipe them how many players you already have in your team that is the first one done now let's move on to the next one so up next we have the premier league one that is the most complicated one of the mix because you need a team of the season player but there's another thing that you can do to make it a little more easier for you so first of all, we'll just start with the goalkeeper. We got Dubrovka and we need a good amount of links here, a little bit of a mix. So I'm going to play Diop at center back with Bralislav Ivanovic on the other end and Cresswell on the left back. So that does it for the some part of the defense. I'm going to, I was thinking of moving Diop here, but then I realized that I could use this right here, which is going to be a little more easier. You could, pl you could put Sidibe and Matuidi right here and that creates a perfect link for them. Uh, put City Bay on uh, nine camp instantly. Then we go on to Torreira again. You might need him a few more times, but in case you de decide to mix it, but if you don't, then this is a pretty good card to add up in random places because of the links that we're going to need now. Like we got Torreira at the center mid, which is going to be a link to Matuidi as well. And then we got three different players at three different price ranges. We got Rossi, we got Lodero. Again, this is going to be a perfect link. And at Cam, we got Fernandez. So this completes the set two. This is going to be a little more expensive. It's going to be around 60 to 70,000 coins because these two cards are dirt cheap, man. Dirt cheap. Like just try and get them. 
the others might be a little more expensive but i've just kept out the gold rank because they will add up to a lot of value which you don't really need in a team right now and the last one that we need is the easiest one in my opinion because all you need is links everywhere and uh, i have made a pretty simple theme that i think everybody should be able to use now the thing is you need two cards that are super cheap that's going to be lunin and for striker we have isak so these two cards are the, are the most important ones and the easiest ones to get i'm putting in jordan henderson right here because why not you're putting a liverpool player so why not henderson and at left back i put the hair for the links and then we start with the important part of the links which are the easier ones to do so Aitor right here with a center back that's going to be Nacho Fernandez and Dani Carvajal at right back at right mid we got Angel Correa with Jonathan Vieira at CDM you can change your position if you'd like but it really doesn't make any difference Ibora at center defensive midfielder and center mid is going to be so Parejo I just said Saul, I know, but you could use Saul, you could use Parejo. I went for Parejo because he was a little more cheaper. And that is it for the set number three. This is going to be a little more expensive in my opinion. These two cards uh, are going to be around 10 to 15k, uh, 20k at max. And then the rest of them are again pretty expensive. So that just completes it. Like I think the Carvajal card is the most expensive because everybody's sniping him. The max price that you can get him for is 25k. So again, that is going to be pretty cheap. Uh, sorry, pretty expensive. And we got De Gea. We got Henderson. Again, we're going to be like 12, 13,000 coins. Isak again, this is going to be about 12, 13,000 coins with Lunin going for base price. So basically, this is it. With these three things done, you will get yourself this beautiful, beautiful card which is the Curtis Jones, which I'm definitely going to be adding into my team in just a bit. But before that, I'm just going to show you my team and why I feel that he is going to be an amazing part of my team. I was thinking of taking on Wijnaldum from the team because he's left. So if I could just sell him, I might just, I might just go ahead and sell him because of the rarity that he has. Bring in Sadio Mane at left wing and uh, Andy Robertson at left back and the team is done. Just imagine Curtis Jones here. Just imagine Curtis Jones here. And I'm done. And I'm done with this game. So that is it for this video, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you'd like to watch more videos, go ahead and watch the other videos on the channel. I've also got the solution for the Stefan El Sharavi, which was the cheapest one that you can do right now. Really amazing card. I have used it. I might just do a small player review in the end, but I'm not doing about I'm not thinking about that right now. And that is it for this video, guys. Thank you for watching. And stay tuned for more. Until next time, peace. Thank you.